Okay, so today we're actually going to be trying something a little bit different, more uh, unorthodox than what our traditional videos are. It's going to be kind of a vlog style coverage. Uh, friends of ours at Eurowise are actually having a get together, barbecue, uh, and BYOB event. And so I'm going to go down there, check it out, do a little bit of video coverage. This is kind of in preparation for uh, the show European Experience, which is coming in a few weeks. And we're going to do some coverage like this of that. So this is going to be kind of an intro to that. Uh, also, for anybody who's a fan of ours who wants to come hang out and you're going to be at European Experience, uh, again, it's in Savannah, Georgia, uh, we have a get together happening on Friday night. And the link will be in the description below to that event. Oh, this new crazy mother. Okay, so before I go, I actually have to stop, get some food and beer because it is a BYOB and bring your own food event. the supplies we're on our way Things are kind of winding down and all the craziness is over. I uh, wanted to check out one vehicle that Eurowise actually just finished building uh, for a customer of theirs. It is a Mark 1 Caddy pickup with a VR6 engine in it. Uh, Eurowise actually is just finished completing kits uh, for these builds to swap the 24 valve VR6 engine into Mark 1 engines. They have a lot of swaps that actually go into uh, Mark 1s as it is, but this is the first one that they've developed for this specific engine. So, Mike, you want to talk a little bit about that? Sure, yeah, we just finished this uh, 81 Caddy truck. It's a 2004 R32 engine that boasts a five speed transmission, and we actually offer a full mount kit. This is actually basically a plug and play setup for our 2004 R32 engine platform with a five speed transmission. So, a la carte, we offer the engine harness, we offer the downpipe and a cool exhaust system, uh, and also cooling system. So, you can put all the things together or separately and adapt a 3.2 liter VR6 motor to a Mark 1 chassis to, you know, basically a Rabbit Caddy Cabriolet. Which is obviously uh, any VR6 in a Mark 1 is going to be a lot of power. Uh, when you put a 3.2 in, it's going to be obviously even better. I don't see, I don't see. 